7.30 right now. We are starting off this vlog in my bathroom because I'm about to do my hair. Yes, you heard me, my hair. It's the night before game day. It was the night before game day. This weekend we were playing Texas A&M in Texas, so we are flying to the game tomorrow, which is also game day. So, since the game is at noon, we are leaving bright and early. Our meet time to head to the airport is 5.15. We're leaving for the airport at 5.30, and I believe our flight is around 7. With that being said, I'm gonna do as much as I can tonight to try and get my- that was dramatic. Get myself ready for tomorrow. I recently discovered sleeping in my cheer hair. We had like an appearance or something the day before games. I honestly just like fell asleep in my hair because I was exhausted and did not feel like brushing out all the teas. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna sleep in my hair tonight. So I did and I woke up the next day and literally had to touch up like two curls and it looked great. <laughs> So that's what I'm going to be doing. I recently got my hair cut and I got a bunch of like layers. Let me backtrack. I had layers and then my hair grew obviously. So we kind of trimmed up the layers. So my hair is very layered right now. I'm curious to see how it's going to turn out. I plan on going to bed at around 8.30 because I have to be up at 4 a.m. Which I'm sure this should be fun because it's a Friday night. So all of like the people in my apartment that live here are going to be partying it up until like 1 a.m. So we'll see if I really even get any sleep tonight. I got a spray tan a couple hours ago and I made chicken, mashed potatoes, and green beans for dinner. They were so good, it was so good. I finished it in like two seconds. Ah, uh, this sucks that I have to tease my hair right now because you know when you have your hair stylist, like wash your hair, dry your hair, do like the whole blowout thing? Yeah, that's where mine was at. <laughs> it's nice and soft. We're also flying home tomorrow night, so it's really just like fly there, play the game, hopefully win the game, and go home. It's nice that it's a noon game. I'm, I'm kind of vibing with noon games, especially because the weather is getting cooler. Because you're done with the game by like 4, you have the rest of the day. I think the weather tomorrow is supposed to be like high of 70. So we're wearing liners. Next weekend is our last home game, which is crazy. Right now is the point in the season where volleyball is going on, football is going on, and men's and women's basketball is going on. So it's just a crazy, crazy time. I love basketball. Basketball might be my favorite sport. Good morning. It is 4.58 and I'm about to leave. Should put my shoes on. Sleeping in my hair overnight was clutch. Very happy that I did that. Okay, I think I'm good. Let's go down the list. So I have bow, lashes, lipstick, Pearls, both uniforms, correct shirt, correct pants, warm up jacket, my pom poms, I have snacks, I have deodorant, I have touch ups, I have an ID. Let's go beat the Aggies. It's the next day. Oh my god. 
Yesterday was full of traveling because we went back home the same night of the game. So we won the game and then hopped on our bus and then hopped on our plane and then hopped on another bus and then hopped on my scooter and then I made it home. And by that point, I was way too tired to pick up the camera. So I apologize. I was knocked out on the plane, like literally was asleep the whole time. Game days, I feel like, always take a big toll on my body. I'm not sure if that's because I'm getting old or what. Sundays are usually my day to kind of recover. These are the pixie eye masks, and they're really expensive, so I hope they work. But I'm thinking that I'm going to go to Starbucks and read my book in the little cafe area while I drink my coffee. That just sounds really nice. Ooh, my hair is soft. And Sundays are also like my chore days, so I'm gonna do some chores once I get home from that. So yeah, I'm gonna continue this vlog today. We'll see what the day takes us. Here's the outfit of the day if you're curious. Just I got a little gray hoodie on, my Lulu fanny, biker shorts, and my gray Nike Dunks. I'm gonna go make something to eat before I go to Starbucks so I don't waste extra money. So smart. And then we'll head out. Here's what I made. Oh my gosh, it's so good. So it's Dave's Killer Bread with tomato, mozzarella, and salt. And it has pesto. It's like a vegan pesto from Trader Joe's. This is a copycat sandwich that I found at Starbucks. Starbucks makes it, and I had it once, and I was like, bro, I can make that. And so I made it. I did not have my game day Starbucks or even game day coffee. It just feels so wrong. from Princess Polly and I thought I would do a little unboxing. I'll show you what I got. I'm not going to try them on because I post a lot of TikToks for Princess Polly. If you want to see these clothes in detail, like what they are, what size and stuff, go check out my TikTok. It's just Riley Nicole Andrews. Oh, I'm so excited for this. I've wanted one of these for so long. It's the Sarah play suit in black. It's a zero, but it looks kind of big. So we'll see how it looks when I put it on. Can y'all guess my favorite color? Huh. It's black. I also got the Charlotte bodysuit in black. I love a good straight neckline. I feel like it's so flattering and like classy. You can dress that up or dress it down. Just needed a good long sleeve bodysuit. This is what I'm really excited for. I got this phone case. Let me take it out of the packaging. It's like a mirror case and it says major look. So when you take mirror selfies, it's like major look. But when I read it, it's backwards. It's really cool. And then, you know, I had to be basic and follow every other girl on the internet and get these boots for Uggs. Uggs, whatever you want to call them. They're not Uggs. They're Princess Polly. They're a little cheaper than Uggs, yet they look the exact same. Has the Princess Polly logo on the back. Fuzzy on the inside. These are the shoe for the fall and the winter. I just wish it would get a little colder in Gainesville so I could wear them. As soon as it drops below 60 degrees, these are going on. And that's all that I got in this haul. I want to put my phone case on. I love it. I love it. I just cleaned the apartment. Look how nice it looks. I'm running some laundry right now and there. Took the trash out. Have a nice little candle burning. Also clean my room. She's cute and clean. Bathroom is clean too. Oh, hey. I vacuumed. We have a nice little candle burning. This is the sun-drenched linen. So it's going to smell like fresh linen. I think I'm going to throw on a little Pilates workout. And look at the, the line from that turtleneck we wore yesterday. Crazy. I'm going to do a little Pilates workout because it gives you like a nice burn. It's not like too intense of a workout, but it's still something. I did one the other day and I felt great after. Really was so pretty looking into the clams, but it gets a lot better when it doesn't exist. I'm done with my workout and I think I'm just gonna chill for the rest of the day so I think I'm gonna end the video here thanks for following along this game day weekend I hope you enjoyed it I had a lot of fun really really cool experience Texas A&M was amazing I would love to like go to Texas and kind of explore outside of I want to go to Dallas or Houston eventually we'll do a travel vlog eventually so stay tuned for that but with that being said I will see you in my next video bye